Chinese army vehicles are commonly marked with a series of numbers and letters, but what do they mean? A lot of information can be gleaned from these markings, so much so that you'll often find them censored in PLA press releases. PLA tactical markings identify the unit vehicles are a part of from the army to company level. In this video, I'm going to break them down and give real-world examples. As a disclaimer, much of this is based on the interpretations of mill watchers who are more knowledgeable than myself, since the PLA isn't like the US in terms of freedom of information. While PLA press releases and CCTV specifically identify certain units sometimes, it's not 100% universal or exhaustive, so take it as a guideline. First, for ground forces units, tactical markings typically consist of two letters and six numbers. They're normally split into two four-character sequences representing the theater command, group army, brigade, battalion, company, and individual vehicle number. This is a relatively new system. Most pictures you'll find from the mid-2010s have an outdated three-number system. The smaller sequence starts with an L, with the second letter designating the vehicle's theater command. China is split into five joint theater commands that control their subordinate group armies, as well as two semi-independent military districts in the far west. LX represents the Western Theater Command while LS and LJ represent the Tibet and Xinjiang military districts respectively. While technically in the Western Theaters area, the latter have their own subordinate jurisdiction over their respective provinces. LN is for units in the Southern Theater Command bordering Southeast Asia and the South China Sea. LD is for the Eastern Command focused on Taiwan. LB is for the Northern Command bordering Russia, Mongolia, and the Korean Peninsula and LZ is for the Central Theater Command, which is responsible for the defense of Beijing and acts as a strategic reserve. The first number following the letters represents the Group Army, which is a roughly core-sized formation. The exact meaning seems to be a little more inconsistent, but they appear to be ordered sequentially, so a 1 would mean the first Group Army in a Theater Command. The 78th Group Army is the first army in the North sequentially, so it's numbered LB1, the 82nd Group Army is the second army in the Central Command, so it's numbered LZ-3. But this isn't consistent, and some even numbers have been seen with certain group armies. LZ-4-1 is used for an artillery brigade in the Central Command with PLZ-5 155mm SPGs. The 76th Artillery Brigade in the Western Theater Command was also spotted with LX-2-1. And there's also this case of the PCP-1 automatic mortar in the 75th Group Army with LN-44, attributed to the Army's Special Operations Brigade. While this is an inference and not confirmed fact, I believe that in some cases they're using odd number sequences for maneuver brigades within group armies, and then even numbers for other types of brigades like artillery brigades or special operations. The fourth number in the sequence pertains to the Combined Arms Brigade, also presumably ordered sequentially. The next four numbers identifies the vehicle's placement within that brigade. The first number shows the brigade-level subunit, usually a battalion. The second number, the company within that battalion. And the last two, the number of the vehicle itself within the company. At the brigade level, most brigades have a headquarters, four maneuver battalions, a recon battalion, artillery battalion with howitzers, rocket artillery, and ATGM carriers, an air defense battalion, combat support battalion with things like signals, chemical defense, engineers, and electronic warfare, and a service support battalion with logistics and medical. One concrete example of the combat support battalion is of the GSL-130 minefield breaching vehicle, an engineering asset seen here with an 8. You can also tell when artillery is brigade-level artillery and not a battalion-level SP mortar when it has the 6 as the first number, like this tracked 122mm MLRS. If it has something else like a 1, 3, or 5, and it's not a self-propelled mortar, it's probably in an artillery brigade. It's relatively easy to tell if it's in an artillery brigade anyway, since the Army's 155mm SPGs and big Smirch-type missile artillery are only in artillery brigades or divisional artillery. But since artillery brigades have a variable amount of battalions, it could give some clues as to how many artillery battalions are in that specific brigade. 
Within the battalions, the company numbering is self-explanatory, although there are some notes. The headquarters will usually be zero, and the maneuver companies and combined arms battalions or fires companies and artillery battalions will follow. In heavy and medium battalions, which have four maneuver companies, the fifth company will be a firepower company, which includes the self-propelled mortars, and the sixth company will be a service company. But in light battalions, there are only three maneuver companies, so the fourth company will have the mortars. So bringing it all together, this is a ZBD-4A on a train. It's part of the Northern Theater Command, LB, the first group army in that command, and the 6th Brigade under that group army. It's in that brigade's 1st Combined Arms Battalion, 1st Company, and Vehicle Number 4 in that company. This ZTZ-99A is also part of that same theater, group army, brigade, and battalion, but it's in the 3rd Company, a tank company, and Vehicle Number 1. Here, we have a PLZ-10, a battalion self-propelled mortar. It's part of the Central Theater Command, LZ, the 1st Group Army within that command, and the 5th Brigade in that group army. The 4 means it's in the 4th Maneuver Battalion, 5th Company, which is a firepower company in this case, and Vehicle Number 5. And if you'd like to learn more about those brigades and firepower companies, check out this deep dive into Chinese artillery capabilities, platforms, and units when compared to the US. We'll see you over there.